We hope you've had a chance to check out the all new Merch Wizard Resizer tool, now in beta and available to all Merch Wizard Pro and Elite tier subscribers. This quick video will show you all the features, exactly how it works, and what to do if you experience any issues. Let's get started. The Merch Wizard Resizer will become visible and available to you once you've uploaded a design file to the uh, Create Multiple Products beta screen in your Merch by Amazon account. You can see the new Resizer features added once you click the Edit Details button on any product that uses the standard 4500 by 5400 PNG design file size. Let's switch to a lighter color t-shirt so that it's easy to see the limits of the canvas, which is the full Merch by Amazon print area. In addition to that area, you'll see the resizer has added a grid overlay to crop around the image, as well as the new Merch Wizard resizer panel, which you'll find below. The panel contains resizing buttons that will allow you to zoom in and out, a reset button, and a hide resizer button. Since you may not always want the resizer visible, we've made it easy to enable and disable the tool. Simply click the Hide Resizer button, the eye icon with the slash through it, and the resizer tool will be deactivated. To reactivate the tool, just click the Activate Resizer button. It's easy to use the resizer cropping grid as well as the zoom in and zoom out buttons to create new product files that are perfectly padded, positioned, and centered. You can zoom in or out and then use the handles to choose the canvas around your design. While you can use any of the handles, if you stick with the center handles, your design will always remain centered too. To customize positioning and placement, you can drag both the resizing grid as well as the image itself. To drag and reposition your design, simply click on the dim design canvas outside of the resizing grid and drag. To move the resizing canvas itself, click within the grid and drag there. Keep in mind that you can zoom in and zoom out and resize freely without the worry of degrading the quality of your image file. You can easily switch between creating hoodie design files and pop socket design files. Once you switch to create pop sockets, you'll notice a color picker has been added to the Merch Wizard Resizer panel. The default color is black, so if you do not choose a background color, your pop socket design file will have a black background. You'll also notice that when creating pop socket design files, there's no circle in the resizing grid. This represents the outer edge of the product, so you'll still want to leave some space to accommodate the trim line. Just be sure to take a look at your uploaded pop socket details to ensure that you're happy with the placement before submitting the product. When you download your new design files, they'll be named according to whatever is present in the product title field, and then the product type will be appended. So title-hoodie or title-popsocket. When you click the button to download the file, your file will be saved to your default downloads folder, or you'll be prompted to select a download location depending on your Chrome download settings. You can create and download as many files as you like. Once you've downloaded your files, you can easily load them to the appropriate file types, check you're happy with the results, and submit your new products. As you move to other products or run into any small issues along the way, you may find the image placement does not appear aligned. You can always hit the reset button on the resizer panel to reset the grid. Please note this feature is still in beta and you may run into some bugs. One thing we suggest is waiting for your image to fully load before clicking the edit details button to open the product detail view. However, if things don't seem to be working quite right, most issues can be resolved with a simple refresh of your browser. If a refresh doesn't work, go ahead and give your Chrome browser a restart. And if that doesn't work, please submit a support ticket on our website, merchwizard.app, so we can help you get things sorted out and get you up and running quickly. We hope you love the Merch Wizard Resizer. 